Hi Pisces, this is Michelle Patterson with Angel Souls and this is your July 2014 Angel Oracle Card Reading and I am using the Healing with the Angels Oracle Card deck by Doreen Virtue. So let's see what you have up for this month. First card up we have Answered Prayer. Okay, so everything that you've kind of been waiting on, you're going to be seeing results in July. Now, what do we always say? Don't get attached to outcome. <laughs> okay, a lot of times people overlook the answer to their prayers because it didn't show up exactly the way that they thought it would or the way that they thought it should. Really, 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 the biggest thing that you can do right now is let go. Get into a state of allowing, okay? That is when you release resistance, that's when things are really gonna start flowing in your life. So don't block out the things that you deserve. Don't block out the things that the universe is trying to bring to you by trying to control the situation, okay? So let it go, let it flow. I hate that I just said that, but there it is. <laughs> it will, y'all can make fun of me, it's fine. Anyway, next card up is ideas and inspiration. Okay, so this is wonderful, especially for you guys. So get out there, start tapping it. They're saying some of the gifts and some of the answered prayers are coming through inspiration. So that might be inspiration to make a move towards, um, a project or make a move towards something that's really near and dear to your heart okay so um but again block 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 there's like lots of blocks around lots of worrying um so you, you really <laughs> how do I want to put this you really need to make sure that you're meditating and clearing your chakras and clear away um, people's opinions and people's expectations of you that's another thing so that your own ideas and your own inspiration can flow freely and that's what I think you guys are I think you're getting a little gunked up by other people's opinions and everybody telling you how it should be tap into your own intuition and let that flow because that's where the real magic is okay Next card up, we have Harmony. All right, so finally, when you, like like we said, release the resistance and you come into harmony within yourself and you start standing up for yourself and you start standing in your integrity and you are who you are and you're not letting anybody else define you, people start getting along with you a little bit better. Now, you're probably sitting there going, no, -uh, if I sat there and I stood up to so-and-so, they'd freak out. They might, but eventually they're gonna have a lot more respect for you because you tapped into who you really are, okay? And I said this for another sign too. Once you tap into the harmony within you, it radiates out, okay? I don't know what's been happening for you guys in the past couple of months, but in July, I'm feeling this big, like almost like you have to like pick stuff off of you, <laughs> you know? Um, whatever you know like worries or um maybe what you consider failed ideas they're coming through with that too feeling like well that didn't pan out therefore meh i'm gonna give up it's over it's not over okay whatever you had going on that didn't come to fruition it just needed to be revamped all right so you're gonna be Again, tapping into your ideas and inspiration and something's gonna make sense. You're gonna get some sort of miraculous solution that then puts you at peace, all right? So up until then, I feel like you're kind of like, I don't know what it is for you and how it will play out for everybody will be different, okay? But it's definitely going to make you feel like job well done and sort of a ah, kind of moment by the end of the month, okay? So go ahead and reach out for your dreams and don't be afraid to put your head in the clouds a little bit, all right? You're designed for that. There are reasons why people come in with the certain blueprints that they do, which is what I see the natal chart, the uh, astrological natal chart as being. It's sort of your blueprint, okay? So you're coming in under a certain influence, under a certain energy to accomplish a certain task in this world, okay? And, and you are the dreamers, so dream away, all right? And the final card, I believe, right? What do we do, three cards? Yeah. So the final card is signs. Okay, so here we go. We're talking about <laughs> releasing. And once you do that, here comes your synchronicities. Here come those opportunities you've been waiting for. Okay, but they're coming. The, the angels are saying that they're gonna guide you um, in baby steps. But like we tell everybody, you have to be wide open to see the signs. Those are the messages. 
So if you have your head down and you're worrying about something or you're letting yourself get worked up because somebody else said something to you and you felt like it wasn't right of them to say that to you, you might have your head down and the sign is over here <laughs> kind of thing. You know, I'm just using that as an example. But really keep, yeah, and you know, we can all take a cue from, from the message for you. We all need to stay clear. I cannot say it enough because the first half of this year has been completely held up with retrogrades, <laughs> right? And us having to do things over and really looking within and cleaning up some stuff. So this is sort of the big premiere for you. You stepping out being who you are, okay? And you might need to adjust a little bit before you just hop into your new way of being, okay? So be patient with yourselves. Look for the signs. Try not to dismiss it. We also don't encourage you to read into every little thing. You know, you, <laughs> it'd be discerning, okay? But if you've asked for the help, remember, angels can't help you unless you invite them in. If you've invite the, excuse me, invited them in and they're giving you signs, trust the guidance that's coming to you. And that's the big thing they're saying. Don't, don't doubt. Don't doubt, okay? Because that's, that's what's getting a lot of you in trouble, it seems. <laughs> like, you know, you keep asking for a solution and they're giving you a clear sign on what to do to make something happen for you and you're like not seeing it, okay? So tune in, guys. Take care of yourselves and just be you, all right? Have a great month. And of course, I am sending you all my love. Take care.